and I am the Aesthetic Nurse Injector at Of Me. And today I'm going to talk about what a unit of Botox is. So a lot of people get very confused when we're talking units of Botox and they have no idea what one unit of Botox is. So today I'm going to do a short demonstration on how Botox comes and how we reconstitute it. So um, Botox actually comes in a powder form. So it's basically a glass bottle and the neurotoxin is in the bottom and it's a white powder. Your provider dilutes this in a way that they want to use the product. So we dilute ours one to one. So what that means is we draw up one cc or one milliliter of bacteria static. So normally it's diluted with just bacteria static or sodium chloride. Uh, so I'm going to draw up that one milliliter and then it is injected into the Botox vial. This is gently mixed and this is how we distribute the Botox. So our one to one ratio means for every unit of Botox, I'm going to draw up one unit with this syringe. So just to give you an idea, if you were to get 20 units of Botox, that's how many units of Botox. Units is the way that we measure how much Botox you're going to get. It's just like when you're taking medication and it says take one milliliter, um, just like when you're paying for something and it's one dollar, that's how we measure Botox by units. So each area has a range of units that are required to properly treat the area. For the forehead lines, I use between eight and 15 units on a female and anywhere from 15 to 30 units on a male for the forehead lines. Between the eyebrows, it ranges anywhere from 15 to 30 units on a female, and on a male, it can range anywhere from 20 to 60 units. Men have much stronger muscles, so they require more units of Botox. Around the crow's feet, this area can take anywhere from 8 to 15 units on a female, and anywhere from 10 to 30 units on a male. So again, one unit of Botox is a very small amount, we reconstitute it and then we draw up the Botox. I use one syringe per area. As you can see, the needle I use is a very small needle. Um, it's an insulin BD syringe, so no, it does not hurt. You'll feel a little pinch, but it's very quick and people get through it very easily. I use a different syringe per area. If I'm doing this side, I'll use this and I'll change my needle each time so that way it helps with comfort so the needle doesn't dull out. So I hope this helps for a unit of Botox. So if your injector says, you know, they recommend 45 to 50 units, at least now you know how small a unit is and that it can require that much product to properly treat the area. If you like this video, please comment below or if you have any questions about it, please ask. And if you like it, give me a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Thanks.